Hello YouTube, this is Super Apple Forever. So we're going to be doing the unboxing of my mom's 13-inch MacBook Pro. So she's finally upgrading from a PC to a Mac. She's been using a not-so-good uh, HP Inspiron. Uh, I think it has a Pinium in it. Uh, it's, a, it's an okay computer, but um, it's getting slower and older. So uh, this is the brand-new MacBook Pro. It's the fastest 13-inch model. You can see the specs there. Uh, 2.7 gigahertz dual core, dual core, uh, i7, 4 uh, gigs of RAM, 500 gig hard drive, and uh, the awesome Intel HD graphics with 384 megabytes of RAM. So we're just gonna get started now. So of course we're gonna cut this. And you can see the box, MacBook Pro. And so, of course, the very nice packaging with this and the laptops in here. So you just pull up here and the laptop comes out. And we're going to put it to the side. And I forgot to mention that we're going to be also unboxing this, the hard shell for the MacBook Pro. So um, here we have the uh, MagSafe adapter for charging. And we really don't need to look at this. And then, of course, in here we've got the Everything Mac and everything else with the microfiber cloth and the Apple stickers and the software disk. So we've got the microfiber cloth in here. And then we've got the software stuff in here with the Apple stickers. And that's pretty much what's in here. So, um... Here's the laptop, very uh, small, well not so much small but very light, uh, not very thick, it's only an inch thick. So we're going to uh, pull back the plastic here, up on the other side. So uh, for the ports, we have a MagSafe, of course, the Ethernet, the uh, FireWire 800, uh, the new Intel, I forgot what it's called, but uh, it's on the box, the Intel uh, Thunderbolt. So the new very fast Thunderbolt connector that's like uh, transfers gigs per second, and then two USB 3.0 ports, the SD card slot, and the headphone jack. The only thing about the 13 inch is that it doesn't have the audio input jack that the 15 inch has. So uh, we're going to lift it up now. And then we have the very nice black backlit keyboard and the multi-touch trackpad, glass trackpad. And uh, we have the screen cover. So um, you can see that it's a pretty nice screen. It's got the 720p FaceTime camera. And of uh, the super drive, of course, and the Kensington lock. So we're gonna power it up now. And we've got the um, swirl, so that means it's booting up correctly. Okay, so we're going to have to choose our language, and then we're going to see the intro video. So English, of course, and then it's going to start the intro video. As you can see, we've got the backlit keyboard.
So we're in the U.S., of course. And then United States. And uh, we're going to do not transfer my information right now since it's a new Mac. And then we're going to uh, choose a network and put in the Apple ID and everything, and we'll see you in a second. Okay, so um, I unfortunately forgot to record, but I have not done a single thing with the computer. It just brought it to the desktop. So uh, what we're going to do now is uh, we're going to... Um, I'm, we're, we're going to customize it the way it needs to be. I'm going to put some programs on it, and then once I bring it back, or once we continue recording, we're going to put on the uh, hard shell case, and we're going to um, do a Geekbench test and do some other things. So um, I'll see you in a second. Okay, so I've finished uh, moving everything to the computer, and I have um, I have also um, you know uh, put some programs on it and stuff. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do Geekbench stuff. So um, I've already done it, and it gets about a 6,000. Uh, my 15-inch MacBook Pro gets a, a 9,000. But we're going to try this one out. Okay, so almost 7,000, which isn't bad at all. So, um, we've got processor, uh, 5,258, uh, memory performance, 5,792. Let's see, um, so you can just see all this stuff here, which isn't too bad, really, um, for the 13-inch MacBook Pro. Okay, so um, now we'll try, you know, like other stuff. I'll open a bunch of applications at once. Open all the um, Office Suite stuff. This, let's see what else I can open. I'll open App Store, iPhoto. Well, actually, no, I can't open iPhoto. Okay, uh, iTunes. And um, let's, so that's, you know, it just handles it all very well. And then I'll open um, activity to see how much it's pushing the computer, which really isn't that much. Activity monitor. So um, it's it's only using three or five percent of the processor on the computer. So you can see there, or you, maybe you can see it right here. It's only using about four percent of the processor, which isn't bad at all. So I'll just quit that and quit everything else here. Okay, so um, I'll just get on YouTube and go to my channel. And we'll watch it in 1080 just to watch it in 1080. Oh, YouTube, even, even though the screen isn't capable of displaying 1080p, I think it can only do uh, 720. I will just do it anyway. I don't understand why it's doing this. Okay. 1080p. And then it's going to buffer, of course. So this is the unboxing of the white iPhone. You can see me in the screen. I'm just holding the camera so down here so it'll look our uh, so it won't shake as much.
Okay, so um, you can see that it displays Flash, YouTube, everything uh, perfectly. Of course it is because uh, it's brand new, but we'll quit Safari. And, and really, that's it. It really, it does everything great. Of course, it's not, I haven't used it very much. If It's my mom, so I, I have used it a little bit. And um, I have Aperture on here if you want to see Aperture. Hopefully there's nothing private on there. Let me see if I can find it. I know I put it on here. Oh, there it is. So you can see that it opens Aperture pretty fast. And really, that's it. So if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to ask me. And uh, thanks for watching.